For the centerpiece of our 2017 festival, we've chosen to do Campras Le Carnaval de Venise. And the reason is because we've done a lot of Lully, the Tragédie Lyrique, and now this is the next generation, and suddenly dance is the centerpiece of the form. It is important because Le Carnaval de Venise is one of the first opera ballet, a new genre, created by Campra uh, two, two years before Le Carnaval, which is an opera which gives dance a new role, not only decorative, not only formal, but also narrative and giving a special atmosphere. We're very excited about the dance in Carnival because we have, for one thing, we, it's an opera ballet, or some people would say it's a ballet. Um, we have eight professional dancers who have all worked with us, specialized Baroque dancers, and we're thrilled to bring in two young artist dancers also. So we'll have a company of ten professional dancers. Le Carnaval de Venise of Campra is a unique piece because not only is it in opera ballet, so there's a lot of dance involved, and it takes place during carnival, so everyone on the street and on the stage is in masks, so it's a, a big party. But during the, the plot of the opera, uh, they decide to go to the opera in Venice. So there is an opera within the opera, and because they're in Venice, the opera that they go to is in Italian. So in the middle of an opera in French, you have an opera in Italian on the Orfeo story in the middle, and then they have a big dance party uh, at the end after that. Mm -hmm. 